Hi everybody, um, this is Future Max. I'm editing this video. Uh, if you don't want to watch, like, it's like me talking and driving. It's pretty boring. It's it's really boring. But uh, if you like me, it's not that boring. <laughs> but um, that's just a heads up. It's mostly it's it's. I didn't edit it much. I just kind of left it, let it run. Um, so that's just a heads up. Thank you. All right. <laughs> What's up, everyone? Um, okay. So, currently, 10, 19. Um, I'm on my way to get corona tested. Now, this is a horrible angle. Is that better? Not really. Okay, um... So, yeah, I'm going to get corona tested because I called my doctor because I was having I what I thought was a sinus infection and I believe to be now allergies, really bad allergies because that does happen to me. Um, no fever ever, no cough, but I'm a ball of anxiety when it comes to any illness and this coronavirus thing has been freaking me out so this is my little uh you know anybody who has awful anxiety and you're going through this whole coronavirus thing and this is like your nightmare well i'm right there with you and i'm gonna show you what it's like to get tested <laughs> i'm so scared i'm scared I'm scared of getting the thing shoved up my nose. That's mostly what I'm scared of. Yeah, I think that's all I'm really scared of. Um, yeah, so with, uh, with it, it's weird because with, with anxiety, there's like, you know, there's logic and there's emotion, right? Okay, hold on. Bye. There's logic and there's emotion. And my logic says, Max, you, of course, don't have coronavirus. You've been sitting in your house. You don't, you know, you don't have coronavirus. You're, you're fine. And that's that. And then there's emotion and anxiety. Hold on again. And that part goes, oh my God, you, you do. You have coronavirus. And so, you know, learning to balance the two not letting emotion be number one and not being so logical that, you know, you don't look out for yourself. But, of course, that never, I mean, I'm never that logical. I'm always, I'm always anxious and emotional about something that may or may not be. In this case, it's coronavirus. I don't know. I think, you know, this will be a good testament to look how powerful your brain is because your brain can make you feel, and you know, I'm sure I have allergies and these, these things are going on, but the way I've been feeling lately, like, I just feel so, I, it's gotta be like mostly anxiety and it's crazy that that can do that to your body, but it, you know, this will be a testament. If I come back negative for coronavirus, then you can believe and bet that, you know, our bodies react very physically to anxiety and, um, you know, that's normal. So, there's a big ambulance in front of me. That's hopefully no corona patients in it. Oh, it's dry. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I forgot the bandana to wear around my face. What do I do? Oh man. How did I forget that? It was right there. You dumb idiot. I can't go back. I'm, I'd be the latest balls. 
Anyway, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put something over my face. This? Yes, thank you! Yes, lady! Anyway, it's a drive through I don't know what I was saying, but it's a drive through I hope to God, I know it's gonna go so far in my freaking brain. I know it. Look at me. So I've been practicing with Q-tips. I've been putting a Q-tip really far up my, uh, my nose to see what happens. I get pretty far. It feels weird, but it's not the worst thing in the world. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm nervous for that. That's the only thing I'm nervous for. I don't think it's gonna come back positive. I think I'm fine, and that's that. But I am scared of this freaking test. And that's why I'm filming, because I know there's probably so many people who are so worried, and like, eventually, you know, more widespread testing may be available, and you know, to ease your worries about having coronavirus, because I know a lot of you are probably worried you have it, or, or might, or are gonna get it, or whatever, so let's see how bad this is. Hopefully it's not all the way up uh, forever. Hopefully the tests are, you know, they get better and less invasive, but... For now, I believe they're invasive. I do. I believe that. And, um, that sucks. But anyway, uh, yeah, let me know if, if any of you, because again, my brain, crazy, um, with allergies or with just, just, I got something going on. Post nasal drip, just like, rah, makes me feel sick and gross and nauseous. Let me know if that's normal. I think it's normal. Uh, you know, I'm ask, I'm saying that, but like, I've, it happens every year. I don't know why I'm asking. It's totally allergies. This is totally crazy. I'm, I'm not. I don't have Corona. Or do I? Or do I? So today, we find. Well, no, we don't find out today because the test probably takes like three days to come back. Today's Wednesday, May 6th, I'm gonna venture to guess. Should I drive a little faster? I'm a little late. No, I'm not. Um, yeah, May 6th, here we are. Yep. Take a bite of my Nature Valley bar. smell. <sighs> got in my mouth a little. The fact that there's been an ambulance behind me this entire time, that's got to mean something. It's ironic. A little bit dark. Alright, uh, fuck. I guess I'll fucking turn this on in a second when I get there. Alright, I'll see you in a second. to hear. <laughs> You're a badass! You're a badass! You're a badass. You hear me? Badass. <sighs> okay, uh, yeah, I don't have a fucking mask. This is what I'm doing. How you doing, man? Yeah. Oh my god. I feel like I'm in a movie. I hate this. My heart's beating so fast. Fuck me. It doesn't look that bad. Hello. Hi, all the way down, please. Give your name and your date of birth. Max Flossdorf, 112.98. Okay, I need you to take your foot down, mm -hmm. put your head back. Actually, it'll, it'll be better if you face forward. Thank you. Everybody all right? Long as you can 
Thank you. All good? Thank you. Oh, that wasn't bad at all. Oh, that was not bad at all. Oh my God. I'm so relieved. I'm so relieved. Oh God. It wasn't, it didn't even go up my nose barely. They were like, no, I went way farther when I was practicing. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yes! Oh! God, I was so nervous. For nothing! See? Fuck! Anxiety, man. You're nervous for nothing. I was, I was fine. I was not bad at all. God! <sighs> can't... I can't... I can't believe that was that easy. <laughs> Fuck! I was so nervous! I'm glad I documented that. That was funny. <laughs> it was funny. And also, you know why it was funny? Because I forgot my bandana or mask and I had to use my freaking hoodie. Looking like a dummy. What a noob. I look like a total noob. All right, it's over. I will, uh, I'll talk to you in a second. <laughs> what the hell? Look, I got my, 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 my bandana, finally, I found it. Um, I just got a call. <laughs> it was scary. Um, it's a number from New Jersey, I don't know the number. And they're like, is this Maxwell? And I'm like, yeah. And I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, it's happening. They're gonna say I'm positive for Corona. And then uh, they're like, date of birth, last name. And I give them all that. So I'm like, they're, they're gonna tell me I'm positive. They, that's why they're asking all this information. My stomach is just like in knots, and then they're like, your test came back negative. I'm like. <laughs> so I don't have, I don't currently have coronavirus, which is great. Um, I would like to get an antibody test because I was really, really sick in December. And it'd be nice to know if I maybe have some immunity to it. Immunity. But for now, that's a good thing. I don't currently have it. Um, cool. Cool beans. Yeah, I'll finish this video in a sec. I'm driving right now and I'll uh, do a little outro. But uh, yeah, 